Electric vehicles are becoming less expensive and more popular. People who buy them feel good about reducing emissions and being less reliant on gasoline. But one challenge is finding charging stations here in the city. CBS 2's Dave Carlin reports on a program to create more of them. The owners of cars you plug in are buzzing as they notice more places to charge their electric vehicles. Still, many more are needed. The more people buy them, the more infrastructure you get. There's not enough chargers out there, and the ones that are out there sometimes are not working. Roy Rada is a project manager at Con Edison, and his job is to be part of the solution. His team partnered on a pilot program with the New York City Department of Transportation. To Switching to an electric vehicle is a good option. This internet ad is for the push that just added a 100th location for curbside charging. This one in Ocean Breeze, Staten Island, at the corner of Mason and Seaview Avenues. We're a year in now. The utilization's been huge. So DOT is already talking about targeting 1,000 by 2025 and as many as 10,000 by 2030. The current estimate is 32,000 registered electric vehicles in New York City and Westchester County, according to Con Edison. For the growing number of vehicles, charging is often found included with the price of parking in some underground Manhattan garages, but that can get pricey. The curbside locations are more affordable. Prices are $2.50 per hour during the day and a dollar per hour overnight. That can mean approximately $20 for a full charge, which is a lot less than a fill up with gas. New York State has not gone as far as California in terms of mandating electric vehicle ownership. Barada says that may be coming. For example, school buses are going to be fully electric by 2030. Uh, you know, they start with the city fleets that they control. He says there is a hope that the $7,500 federal tax credit and many other incentives one day get us to the point where going electric, no gas, becomes a no-brainer. In Ocean Breeze, Staten Island, Dave Carlin, CBS2 News. And some free internet apps list all the charging stations in the U.S. and Canada, and some of them even alert you when new public stations open in your area. And we've listed the apps on our website. You can find them there at cbsnewyork.com. A lot of them I see showing up in shopping areas. Just plug it in while you go do your thing. So convenient. Come back. Yeah, definitely. Nice.